are made to feel like they need to be thin and young. It's very, very bad. Very bad. Yeah, like, I, I don't think that you have to look any certain way to be like, like fashion like, you know? Can I film, can I film you? All right, answer, give yeah. me a question, I'll answer. Okay, um, I'll ask the same question. Do you think the fashion industry manipulizes girls' idea of, of how they should look? I do. I do. I do I do believe so. Um, unfortunately, it's, society makes us want to think that we need to be thin, we need to have nice hair, skin, nails, when beauty's in the eye of the beholder. Um, it's who you are on the inside that matters the most, and it's not what you look like on the outside. That's my opinion. Unfortunately, the fashion industry distorts that a tremendous amount, and think it's, it's I think it's wrong. For, do you think it's more for girls than boys? I think it's for both boys and girls. Okay. Absolutely. Um, I mean, you see you see pictures of males on billboards just as you do women, but you know, unfortunately, I hate the sex sells, you know, and I don't agree with it. Yeah. Do you guys think that the fashion industry manip um, manipulates girls' image of how they think they should look like? Um, sometimes I do just you hear about like girls being like go from being too fat when they're already like nine pounds. I think it like that being in like kind of like in the media makes younger girls feel more uncomfortable about them if they're more than nine pounds. more for boys than girls or do you think it's it affects both males and females? I think it affects both males and females because uh, you know for young men there's you know, there's multiple different types of guys but the ones that are more in the limelight are the guys that have the good fingers and yeah. they're in shape and you know it's, it, it make, I think the guys have the same as girls but it's not as bad. And um, the whole part of like human development is people mimicking each other and finding out, oh, well, I like that, so I'm going to strive for that. And the people are looking at magazines and thinking, like, oh, I think she's beautiful. I'm going to look for someone just like that. It's sort of like a tainted view uh, of what is okay. Because with magazines and fashion, they airbrush everything. They perfect it to the point where like there is no detail left undone. And I think that's the falsehood of what is actually real. That a picture is not real. It's just like a photograph of modification. Yeah.
you think that the fashion industry d distorts girls' idea of beauty? Of beauty? Yeah. 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 Do you feel that um, when it's more for male or female and when we identify beauty, some people we've interviewed said that, oh, it should be more natural and it doesn't matter how, if you're thin or, or heavy or not. Right. And some people have said, oh, but beauty is everything. And so just in general, what's your, what's your opinion of what identifies or how women relate to what our opinions are about being beautiful? I think like it should be about being naturally beautiful because that's how people should see us. But there's so much stuff like in the tabloids and news and everything that we have to. I feel like we have to keep up and like compete against each other to like do better. Okay. Right. Um, like all plastic surgery, the makeup, shoes. Like it's, it's hard, you know. Right. So I feel like it's it's more. It's I, I guess not natural beauty because that's what. That's what it's pretty much showing, like you see all that. Right, and then obviously we mimic that for right. either work or whatnot. So for, do you work for the Macy's here? I work for Mac. You work for Mac? So do you feel that because you work in an industry that pushes beauty and oh, makeup? Yeah. Oh yeah. Do you? Okay, yeah. so it's something that you have to do obviously mm -hmm. because of the job in the industry right. that you do, You have to right? keep up with hair, makeup, clothes, looking good. You can't slack at all. Like You have to present that image. Right, so even though you might disagree with the fact that it's pushed, but because it's what you do for a living, you kind of have no choice but to kind of give, give right. that to sell and, or whatnot, right? right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right. Do you think women put too much emphasis on looking younger than they actually are? Um, yes and no. I think it's, I don't think it's a bad thing that women try to look younger than, than what they are. Um, there's lots of women who succumb to having surgery or, um, Botox or all of us actually are, um, suckers for buying products that will cause less wrinkles or, um, skin discoloration. I don't think it's a bad thing. Um, for an example, I work in an industry where there's lots of customer interaction and customer facing and presentations and things like that need to be met. So uh, one has to always look their best and have uh, the freshest, neatest, um, you know, sophisticated look. So um, I, I don't think that too many women focus too much about being there. I, I think it's just a matter that we all still just want to look young and and great, and I don't think there's anything wrong with wanting to to look young and feel young.